Hi guys, welcome back to another weird video. Today it is just me, we're number two. And yeah, okay. Heavenly Father, we confess that we have sinned as the people of ancient Israel sinned in their day. We have polluted our land by shedding of innocent blood through abortion and terrible violence against unborn babies. We have become guilty because of the blood we have shed. We know that their blood, the blood of six zero 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 innocent babies cries out to you you from the ground for justice we acknowledge that if we do not turn from this detestful practice we will bring our days as a nation to a close and the end of our years will come even though we may not have committed these sins ourselves we ask in identification with our people that you will forgive us forgive us Forgive us as a nation for not recognizing your image, the image of God in every preborn pre baby. We confess that we have acted very wickedly towards you. We have not obeyed the commands, decrees, and laws you have given us. Please, Lord, renew a right spirit in us that we may return to you and obey you so that you may gather us and bless us. Raise up spiritual leaders among us who will not do violence to your word or profane your holy things, but instead teach your truth about life with adult, I don't know that word, and in the power of boldness of your Holy Spirit, remove from us spiritual leaders who do not distinguish between what is clean and unclean, who shut their eyes to your truth in your name whitewash evil deeds together we pray for president trump for our lawmakers and for our judges may they use the authority you have given them to do only what is right in your eyes and never to do what is evil in your eyes may they recognize your sacred duty to establish and enforce politics that will protect them from harm and most innocent and vulnerable among us we pray that those who do wrong will learn to live in fear of you as the judge of all living and dead we pray especially for every public official who stands for your truth regarding the sanctity of human life please answer them in the day of trouble and deliver them with the saving might of your right hand may they trust you and though your steadfast love never be moved but to fight all who plan evil against them. And once again, we may honor the sacred value of unborn human life in this land. In the name of Jesus, amen. So this video is completely out of the ordinary. Um, but this is something that's really important to me. So if you are totally for abortion, just please listen to my argument just for a moment. Um, so, you know, the Nazis in World War II, in the labor camps, they were taught that as soon as a man or woman or child entered the labor camps, they were no longer human, they were no good as animals, and what we're being taught today is that a child in the womb is not a human. Well, we can look back in history... And that's what they were being taught. And now we look back on what the Nazis did and we thought, oh my gosh, that's so terrible. How could they have ever done that? And yet we're doing the same thing. We're not learning from history. And I would encourage you to speak up against this. This is babies being murdered. And if you are considering doing an abortion, then, I mean, you don't know what that baby's going to do. I mean, what if it's the first female president of the United States or the first man to live on Mars, or something. And I can promise you, as soon as you see that baby, you're going to love him. And if you're just a child watching this video, and I'm just expressing my opinion here, so... Anyway, thank you for watching this video. I'm s it's a bit out of the ordinary, so... Thanks for watching. Bye!